Hello and welcome. I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Hearts of Iron 4. Germany wins. We're going to conquer this guy. We declared war on Turkey. Alright, so the African Excursion Force. Purple. Fully organized? Not quite. Good enough though, I think. No one feels good about their plan. Purple doesn't have a plan. Purple's army's combat width is 18. Combat width of 20. These guys have a combat width of 16, which is weird. Um, I'm gonna just... Okay, so... African Excursion Force. Clear all orders. Let's just try to get this organized. So the Panzers first. I want you guys to line up here. I want to take the... Purple. Purple is these guys. The darker guys can go here. With a plan to just move into like here. And then you have a plan to take Ans take Istanbul. Um, And that's what we want. Straight into in, straight into Istanbul. And we wait. Turkey's now part of the thing. That's fine. We don't care. We've, ex we've grown to expect this at this point. Approved anti-air is done. Cool. Rocket artillery. Toad rocket artillery. What does this do for us? Defense 12, soft attack 50. Rocket artillery is less accurate and has a much higher, a lower sustained rate of fire than batteries of traditional artillery guns. However, they have the capability of simultaneously hitting a target with multiple rockets with devastating effect. So more breakthrough. Sure. Sounds good. Um, you feel bad about your plan? Or when Rommel says that the enemy is stronger? Erwin Rommel, I disagree with you. And I think you're a pansy. And what are you doing? You, you are protecting against that naval invasion. Which has stopped. But that means you're not really part of the expeditionary force. You're part of more of like... This theater. Naval efforts done. We added two more naval building slots. Research bonus for a couple different ship types. What I want is airplanes. We did, uh... Why were we doing that? Why were, why were we doing... That thing? I guess, what, just because it was available? Naval effort? Plan Z? Plan U-boat? Research for the U-boat 3 type and type 2A. Type uh, 7C and type 11. Or Plan Z. Well, we've already conquered Denmark, so none of this makes any sense. Let's go for the U-boat. Why not? So this is planes with five troops. We've got one, two, three. We have a combat width of, what would that be then, 120? So why wouldn't we want to engage? Oh, you know why? Maybe why is because we don't have any planes in this area. This is Greece, where we have 600 airplanes. Shouldn't we be, be able to easily see, like, uh, the percentage of dominance? Air superiority. I mean, issues with Northern France again. I want to be able to just like click on this and like click drag, like. Take them from this region. Hmm. 
We'll figure it out eventually. And they have eight troops here. Six troops there. They've got a lot. They've got a lot of men there. So we want, like, lots of close air support here. I think we're going to pull quite a few of our airplanes down here. Close air support. Mission efficiency, 86.5%. Assist troops in ground combat. On the other hand, there is a unit type, an air type, I think, an airplane type that does actually, like, kill troops just straight up, doesn't it? Just the tactical bomber. Strategic bomber is about killing infrastructure. Tactical bomber is about bombing... Help out ground troops and bomb enemy buildings. So it is buildings, but... Are we even making the, uh... We're making the Ju-87 right now, yes. 2.87 per day. We've got 400 close air support in storage. We've got more tactical bombers in storage. Alright, Greece. I need airports. We could fit 1,600 planes here, so let's grab some more stuff. That's fine. More close air support, sure. And then let's add some... Tactical bombers? Fighters? Interwar fighters? Sure. And then the bombers. Once those all get deployed, which I really feel like you should still be able to assign them to a job while they're being deployed. Like, why do I have to wait? I hate that. It's really irritating. Strategic bombing? Sure. So we should have quite a bit of support here. Just thinks the enemy's stronger. Close air support only supports us in ground combat. We need to do... Other missions. I really feel like the default should not be no retreat. Enemy troops are getting bombed. We're destroying buildings. I mean, while we wait, we are doing damage to them, but... How do you destroy 0.4 of a building, I wonder? In the last month, we've killed 70 troops. That doesn't seem like very much. Bomb enemy fleets in ports. Sure, you know what? Go for it. Maybe that'll help out. I don't know. What is this? The attacker is... Me. Why is General Claudio attacking? Stop it. All of you, stop it. Why are you doing this? Tw 
20% attrition? Holy crap. I don't understand why he's engaging, but I also don't like this attrition. This is nuts. Where do we see the attrition calculation? Is it just based on supply? Supply map mode. F4. Control of incoming edge provinces. I don't know, I'm not seeing anything like red that shows that we don't have supply, but... That's a lot of freaking attrition, I can tell you that much. Alright, well, we can't just not do anything, so... They say we're weaker, and yet we just took them, like, really easily, so... I don't know. I don't really understand how this thing is measuring up. We have 14 troops there. We can attack with quite a bit here. Let's grab the... We want to take, like, the Panzer Divisions. The ones that are actually somewhat trained. Two Panzer Divisions. Uh, we'll take the Grills. So that's our four. Plus one more. Ninety-two with a combat width of 120, so we're actually looking fine. I don't understand. The game made it seem like it was like really insurmountable odds and yet we're doing fine just marching through here. So, okay fine. So the Panzers, um, cancel your orders. You're now over here. And you're going to go towards this. And the other army. You just get that whole border. And just protect that line. We are suffering 36% attrition. Supported, 51.7. Previous bottleneck infrastructure in Thrace, 43.7. Army, 21. Mountain, 40%. So the mountains themselves, okay, so it's not like a supply bottleneck, it's just, it's just nasty attrition in the mountains.
Why it's purple now? I don't really understand. Oh crap, I accidentally assigned them to a different order, that's why. Um... And Turkey's already capitulated, so... <laughs> Rommel just scared the shit out of him. Okay, move over, rebase. We should see these guys rebase very quickly. Um, but actually I need to... I need to un... Do that order. You know, I should- there should be an easy way to, like, just, like, cancel all their orders. Like, without having to, like, right-click on the cancel all orders button. At least I think. Now, there's, like, no reason at all to not just advance you straight down to here. But we will check the arrow. Seems fine. Just advance. Go. Zero reason whatsoever. There's no resistance. So just act. Go. Why aren't you going? I've enacted the plan. Go. 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 It's too slow for me. Like, you should be moving faster. Meanwhile, we've got Iraq, who is not part of the war, but we've got our access to Africa now. Uh, let's just justify Wargle on Iraq, because, you know, I hear he's a bad dude. We have free military factories. Looks like the, uh, the suppression's been working well. Um, F6 shows how we're looking there. Okay, let's go to the resistance is futile. Do we just need more men? We have a single guy here. A grill trying to defend this. The SS Division, these grills should really not be part of this anyway. They should be part of uh, that army there. Resistance is futile should be the infantry that have been trained up with the, the bonuses. And we should be deploying more of them. Slowly. Let's set priority to upgrades and reinforcements, not to building new units. <laughs> There's just too much to garrison. We have free military factories, so... How many? One. <laughs> well, what do we need to make more infantry, more suppression? More military police. I've read that cavalry actually have better bonuses to suppression, but when I was looking at it, it didn't look like it. They have a suppression value of 8. And my infantry, regular plain old infantry without the military police bonus, have a suppression bonus of 9. So I don't know why the guide that I read said that they are twice as good at suppression. They're not. Suppression is higher with regular infantry. Unless it's saying Suppression 9 because there's 9 infantry. Maybe that's what's happening. Yeah, okay, never mind. Each cav is worth 2 Suppression. Okay, so cav are twice as good. So we should be building some cav for Suppression. Let's do that. I like that. I like that a lot. We're gonna create a, uh... Cavalry Division. We've got two Cavalry Divisions for some reason. This one's got, um... Recon Company Support Artillery. This one's just got recon. Gives better movement, more reliability. A lot less organization. 
Why don't we edit the, the division? I think 10 combat width makes more sense to me. We change this to the military police instead. And do we want to have engineering company or... I don't think we need anything else. So you have a suppression value of 13 and your cheap is dirt. So let's train up some Schnell. Uh, can we rename this actually? Because I'm not going to remember. Uh, resistance is futile. Rename. We want to train... Iron Fist. Train. Let's uh, back off a bit on some of the regular infantry training then, since we actually... I, I had bumped it up a lot. The location will be to here, and you will deploy to Resistance is Feudal. Aw, oh, come on, that doesn't work? Damn. You will, you will deploy to there. And that'll mean that eventually we can move these infantry out of Resistance is Feudal, and then the Resistance is Feudal theater will just pretty much be comp comprised of cavalry, which will do a much better job of putting down the enemy. So what do we need to make resistance is futile? Resistance is futile uses, we want more than one, more than one line for sure. Like, let's start with five. Uh, it just takes infantry equipment. So let's queue up some more infantry equipment. Uh, infantry equipment, we've got one thing, two things making, three things making, Two! Two making infantry equipment. Okay, more infantry equipment. To the top with you. Why does it say 13? Oh, it's because of all the other crap. Gotcha. We'll put it at the very top. Any new factories that come online, we want to just be making infantry equipment. Okay, cool. Alright, well again, I, I feel like not a lot has happened, but I'm learning so much about this game and I'm really starting to enjoy it more and more and more as we get closer and closer to understanding what the hell we're doing. We need quite a bit of rubber. Um... Siam, give me more rubber. Thank you. Okay, we've taken over all the French holdings here. We're just fine claims on Iraq. We've researched the Junkers Ju-87 Kenno Vogel, which is our... Junkers Ju Canoval. It's our close air support plane. Okay, cool. Let's go before I forget then. Find our production lines for that. We're gonna change over you to the upgraded version. I wish that I could filter by just the, the type that makes sense. Close air support too. So we're gonna lose a bunch of production efficiency, but because we're just upgrading to the same support type, we lose a lot more than I expected, holy crap. I thought that it was only going to be 10%, but never mind, we lost a ton. Um, but yeah, we want we want to make the better close air support. Better fighters could be good, sure. We are missing equipment, MSPG. M-S-P-G, the mobile S-P-G. That was the... Grill A, I think. Motorized... Self-propelled... I don't remember what that stands for. M-S-P-G, yeah. We're not making any of them. Uh, let's just stop. I don't want more. Cancel the line. That should make that go away. Unless it's trying to reinforce them. Hey, there was some French resistance here. 
Okay, next up, uh, let's go to the African Excursion Force. So I want you guys... Okay, again, first off, select all units. I wish you could just, like, clear orders. Is there a clear orders button? That'd be so useful. Low supplies in down here. We are over the supply limit by quite a bit right now. Okay, so let's grab the uh, the 24, and then have you guys just go hang out up here. We're gonna have these 24 here take over Iraq, and we're gonna have Rommel with his 24 units of mostly stuff assigned to this line. And he is going to advance to here for now. We'll organize the arrow. Looks pretty good to me. Alright, cool. I'm going to take a break here. See you again in the next episode. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon.